Hi guys, it's Pixels Tech here. In the last video, I showed you how to create a Apple Music Now Playing widget through Widgie. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link in the description below. So we're going to go over to Widgie and we're going to select our previously created Now Playing widget. We're going to click Edit as a Copy. And we're going to quite simply go over to the menu it's the third menu in and we're going to just press the plus button on widget size and that will easily change the size of the widget obviously we now need to rearrange i did show how to move and resize all your assets in the last video but it is as simple as pressing the plus and minus buttons on size and the reposition on the arrows. Just keep moving, resizing and repositioning until you find the layout you want. You can obviously change the text and colors if you wanted to. My buttons here are too close together for my liking. So it's a case of opening the folder, just going into each individual button and spreading them out a little bit. The shortcuts will remain in place. So you don't need to worry about doing anything in terms of changing anything to do with the shortcuts. And unless you're changing the aesthetics, you don't need to change anything within the buttons. Also, I'm going to add a new group just to make it easier to change the music shortcut and the music artist image. That way you can move and resize that with everything in place in one go. So just put all of those in the one folder and you're good to go. So what I'm going to do is fast forward through some of the moving around so you can just see a very quick overview of the process. And there you go. So a really easy way to make sure all of your already created widgets can be used in different sizes. So you can place them where you like on your home screen. It gives you much more control over your theme. And just to show you how it looks on the actual home screen, we'll go to Widgie. We've placed it in the slot that we wanted it to so we're going to go to our large slot and you can see the differences there just to show you that the shortcuts still work i'll just press the play and you can see it's now playing pressing the different shortcuts as you skip and your refresh still works so everything works fine so yeah i hope this helps because it gives you the opportunity to be more creative. And in the next video, I'll show you how to just quickly recolor this widget. So again, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, ring my bell, feed my ego and all that wonderful stuff. And I'll see you in the next one.